What's up, people? Today I'm going to talk about making something I'm calling the Badass Mage Staff, or BAM Staff. And uh, the reason for it is because I've been getting really into staff lately, and I like Glow Toys. Um, and Flow Toys makes an awesome glow composite staff, and it's super cool. Um, I highly recommend it, but it's 200 bucks. Uh, I can't afford it right now, and uh, you know I'm still saving up for a stable of sound. Uh, Ninja Pirates also has a, a, a staff that incorporates Podpoi and Flow Lights, um, kind of similar, kind of similar to the Flow Toys one. And it's a little bit more affordable, but still, um, I just can't do that right now. But uh, with all this crap I have lying around that is used for Flow Arts, I've got PVC and I've got already got my Podpoi, so I just figured I'd I'd put one together myself, and it's really really simple. So. What I have here is some 3 quarters inch PVC with um, Kinesio tape on the outside because I didn't have any grip tape. Um, and what I've done is wrapped it up and then I also wrapped the inside a little bit so that there's a little bit of material on the inside of the pipe. I think this is going to help with gripping the pod poi. And then all you do is you take your current pod poi. Uh, if you don't then this is going to be an expensive staff to make because it's 100 bucks for these. But if you've already got them. Um, it's really easy to reconfigure them. Keep the leash on. You take off this triangle retainer. And it opens up the pedals. And you keep that retainer on there. You don't even have to take it off. And I'm just squishing the capsule and the flow leash down into the PVC. Uh, you leave enough space so that the light still shows. You get as close as you can there. And then you take your triangle retainer and tuck it up under one of these pedals. Create some tension here. And you can wrap right around the base of the pedals. Like so. And then you can overlap. And you can really, you know, pull down on this. It's just a silicone shroud. You get a lot of tension on it. And then for your last wrap, you can place your thumb underneath and poke the flow leash, the handle, up through it. I actually want to get the uh, hardware passed also. So I pull all the way up to the swivel and you pull that down tight. This is just a, a simple clove hitch I believe. Thank you Boy Scouts. And you can just tuck that up right under there. Looks a little bit wonky whenever you're staring at it here but I mean it doesn't get in the way of the light and once it gets moving it's farther away you can't see much going on there. You repeat with the opposite side. <clears throat> and um, now clearly this is not going to be the most stable uh, flow staff. <laughs> There's nothing keeping keeping uh, the pod poi on except for the tension that you create. Um, so what you're going to want to do is maybe bulk up that that uh, inner lining in the tube. That might help you get a more um, a more solid fit and then you can really work on your wrap here and I think that the wraps probably the most vital portion and um, just keep an eye on it you know you want to check between songs make sure that your that your ties are still holding and um, whenever I first made it I was able to play for 20 minutes before I had a Poi go flying, and whenever it did go, it had a lot of velocity. Uh, it, I mean, it flew 20 feet, and so it could definitely be an issue. Um, but it's a compromise. It costs a lot less, <laughs> uh, so I think it's cool. Regarding the structural integrity of the pod poi staff, I just decided to kind of test it. And I mean, 
I feel pretty comfortable about that. Like, that's me really, really going for it. Trying to rip this thing off. And it'll come off, but, like, spin-wise, I think that's just a, a good way to, to test whether or not your, your staff's going to be okay. Also, it's a quick way to release it. I mean, now you got your pump put back. All right. So, you've got these guys tied on securely. You can still access the button. I think that the spirit's really cool. And now you got a butt boy staff. Or a broke ass mage staff. BAM! Uh, hopefully I'll be making a longer one and getting some real deal grip tape. And um, if I do, I will post the update. Enjoy your spinning.